who don't allow black people into their communities. Bilal, the Arabs would say Muhammad's got no one but Bilal. Bilal couldn't recite Adhan properly, you know that. He can't say Ashhadu. He can't say the Sheen. He says Seen. So when he used to recite Adhan, he used to say Ashhadu an la ilaha illallah. Ashhadu. The Arabs would say Muhammad has to keep bringing that black crow up there. Don't think racism in Islam is gone. Still there. Still there. Don't worry. It's still there. There's some Shia in our communities more racist than any non-Muslim. I guarantee you from my heart I say this. Oh, he'll tell you about Majalis and about Abdullah. They'll cry. No, don't cry. Remove the racism. That's okay. Don't worry about crying. We have too many who cry. Bilal, recite the Adhan. He recited the Adhan. Can you imagine when a revert walks into the mosque, he sees someone of his descent reciting Adhan. He feels he's part of the religion, correct? If he sees the same faces only, he'll say, but there's no one from my descent. Is this religion a racist religion? Rasulullah, the first thing he did, he knew there's many Africans joining Islam. Let the Mu'addin be an African so the Africans join. Number two, marry your daughters off to the Africans. You think it was easy for the Arab? It was not easy. It's not easy. Juwaybar comes to Rasulullah. Rasulullah looks at him. He says to him, Juwaybar, said, yes. He said, why aren't you married? He said, Ya Rasulullah, who'll give me their daughter? I'm black. I propose to someone, who's going to give me their daughter? He said to him, uh, Juwaybar. I have come to remove this thing that the black is lower than us. We are all equal in the eyes of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. He said, go and propose to Ziyad bin Lubayd's daughter. Ziyad bin Lubayd was the aristocrat of the Ansar of Medina. Juwaybar came, knock. Yes, welcome. Where have you come from? He said, I've come with a message from Rasulullah. He said, MashaAllah. Message from Rasulullah, welcome. What's the message? He said to him, the message is, I've come to propose for your daughter. Rasulullah has sent the proposal. I am the one coming to propose. He looked at him and said, what do you mean? You? He said, yes. He said, you? He said, yes. He said, but you're... You're black. It's still there today. We can smile. I guarantee you the followers of Ahlul Bayt still. No change. He says, but you're black. How do I give you my daughter? Juwaybar said, I'm sorry. If you don't want to accept me, I'll go back. As he was leaving, he said, wait, wait, come here. Rasulullah sent you? He said, yes. He said, stay here. A proposal from Rasulullah, I can't reject like that. Let me go and see him. He came to see Rasulullah. Rasulullah said, how are you, Ziyad? He said, very well. He said, yeah, Rasulullah. He said, yes. He said, can I ask you something? He said, yes. He said, you sent Juwaybar? He said, yes, I did. He said, Juwaybar, you sent him to propose for our daughter? He said, yes. He said, Ya Rasulullah, but he's... He said, what is he? He said, but you know he is... He said, what is he? Say it! Didn't I come and tell you that all of you are children of Adam and Eve? Didn't I tell you that the Quran says the only difference is taqwa? What is it? He said, I'm sorry, Ya Rasulullah, you're right. This is a disease in me spiritually. A human can have physical diseases. They're never as dangerous as spiritual. Physical, go to the pharmacy, cure. Spiritual, if it kills you, it'll kill you. Anger, hypocrisy, envy, jealousy, all of these are spiritual diseases, correct? One of them, racism. He came back, he said, Jawaiba, he said, yes. He said, you want to marry my daughter? He said, yes. He said, go and talk to her. He came to her, he talked with her, the father then came to the daughter, he said, Are you, do you want him? She said, Dad, what's the problem? He said, but you know he's... She said, Dad, Rasulullah came to remove all that racism. If he's a good human being, I want to marry him. Finished. Finished. Allahumma salli ala Muhammad.
that's why Imam Sadiq's wife from Africa, Imam Al Kadhim's wife African, Imam Al Rada's wife African, Imam Al Jawad's wife African, Imam Al Hadi's wife African. Subhanallah. Imam Al Sadiq, Imam Al Kadhim, Imam Al Rada, Imam Al Jawad, Imam Al Hadi, all their wives African. They can't marry from Medina. Imams don't know what to marry from Medina. Why don't they just marry Arab? African. Al Muhammad went and married African. The followers of Al Muhammad won't give away to African. 